Civil military relations in Ghana have been marked by periods of very discreditable incidents. Since the first coup of 1966, there have been four military takeovers of political power in 1969, 1972, 1979, and 1980. Although relations are becoming friendlier among civilians and the military, there has been a negative perception by a section of the public on their relationship with the military. Speaking to City News after the commissioning of a modern drugs dispensary by the 66th Artillery Regiment in Ho, the commanding officer, Lieutenant Colonel Edward Saponapia, stated that although the facility is situated in the military barracks, it is however open to the general public. He said, with the delivery of healthcare to the military and the general public, the facility will provide an avenue to erase the negative perceptions held by the public against the military and help to bridge the gap between soldiers and civilians. The facility, as I already mentioned, is open to the general public, though it finds itself in the military establishment or in the barracks. And as uh, the civilians come here to patronize the services of this facility, it will help bridge the gap between the military and the civilian, hence enhancing civil military cooperation. So this is a very good project that's going to build that kind of relationship so that that misconception the civilians have, have had over the years or the perception civilians have for soldiers will, will be a thing of the past. According to the commanding officer, the establishment of a drug dispensary or pharmacy in the military facility will benefit not only the military but also the public. You know, this is a military establishment and we don't intend to make that kind of huge profit. Yes, so the prices sold here as compared to those sold elsewhere will not be the same. Here will be cheaper. For our troops, it is very convenient because they don't need to work to walk to town to struggle for these drugs. Now, this facility is also electronically linked to the consulting rooms of the medical doctors. So you, are not, you don't need to take uh, a manual prescription. The moment the doctor prescribes the drugs, it electronically generates all the pharmacy for you to just walk there empty-handed and you, all the details and the drug prescription will be there for you. Guest of honor for the ceremony, Air Commodore Apia Ejikum, Director General, Personal Administration, General Headquarters of the Ghana Armed Forces said, the dispensary will provide easy access to medication to both the military and civilians in the surrounding communities. He also stressed that the idea behind the establishment of the facility is to develop and sustain military-civil relationship. To provide easy access to medications prescribed by the MRS to all troops, families, civilian employees, and to capture the outlying communities so that we develop and sustain military-civil relationship. So this is basically the idea behind this project. Reporting for City News, I'm Desmond Salasiago.